Welcome to Vlogmas Day number one. Um, today has not been a very good day for me, I'll be honest. And I look like poop, and I feel like poop. Um, so without going into too many like details, this morning I woke up to find out that one of my friends from Ohio lost her husband, and they have little children. So if you guys can pray for them, um, I'm like so sad about it. We weren't like best friends or anything, but we were good friends and we talk all the time now that we live in different places, but my heart is just like hurting for her so bad. Anyway, so um, I was going to go to the Bath and Body Works candle sale early this morning with my neighbor and I didn't because I was just like so upset and I didn't get very much sleep last night because I was out really late last night babysitting and so I decided to just stay home. Devin and I got Chick-fil-A for breakfast and it's raining. We're like on a tornado watch. Um, but anyways, I'm getting, it's noon and I'm going to the mall to go to the candle sale because I'm hoping that I can still get some stuff that I want. Online is already all, all sold out. Um, but yeah, sorry for such a crappy start to this vlog. I'm just kind of in a down mood today. Um, and the weather is not helping. So yeah, I'm getting ready to leave. This is a little orange juice, by the way, from Chick-fil-A this morning. Um, but I'm hoping to get some candles. I'm not going to record in there because I already know it's a madhouse. So I'll record when I get there. Um, and then I'll probably just show you guys like a quick little haul. I'm only planning on getting like four to six candles. Because uh, I have like a 10 off of 30. So I'm excited. But I'm hoping that they have what I want. So yeah. I'm getting ready to leave. Alright guys. I just got here. Ooh, can you see me? Yes you can. Um, I just got here and it is pouring. I don't know if you can hear it or tell. But, um, I'm hoping I can get some candles. Um, I don't think I'm going to vlog at all going in there, so I'm just here at the mall, but we will see how it goes. I think it's going to be a madhouse, but we will see. The bag is secured, people. So, I made it out alive. Burning up. It was so freaking hot in there. Um, and, oh, this is my bag. Honestly, it's not as much as it looks. I don't know why they gave me such a big bag, but, all right, I'm going to show you guys what I got. Let's see, I got four candles, one wallflower and one wallflower plug because I had a coupon to get one free plug-in um, and I actually got rid of all mine like before we moved here so I don't have any like actual plug-ins so I had to get a plug-in to be able to get the refill so I just got this gray flower one. Um, they're like really overpriced the like cuter ones so I just get the plain ones. And then the one scent that I got I'll probably go back because I've been wanting to get some Bath and Body Wallflowers because these are honestly the best plugins for your house if you're looking for something to actually make your house smell. Like the Glade, those, like they don't really work. The only ones that I really think actually work are the Airwick ones. Uh, but I got Cinnamon Spiced Vanilla. I didn't even smell it. It was a madhouse in there. So I got those two things and then I got four candles. So the first candle I got and I was trying to get out of my like comfort zone because I always get the same candles and I'm very picky when it comes to candles. Hopefully you guys can hear me. I'm sorry if that's annoying. Um, I'm very picky when it comes to candles because I don't know. It can't be too strong. Um, I don't really like flowery scents. I don't. I really tend to go for like sweeter food scents. But I, I smelled this one and it's rose water and ivy. And it's so pretty. Like the candle is so pretty. And it smells like um, I have a rose water champagne, something like that, like a hand lotion, and I really like it. So I don't know. It smelled really good. And it's a really pretty candle. And I already have some Christmas candles. You guys saw me haul those a while back, but um, so I wanted to get ones that I could kind of use all around, like all year round instead of just Christmas time. So I got another marshmallow fireside. I'm pretty sure I got like a little one last time I was here. This one is like a sweet masculine scent and I really like masculine scented candles. Those are like one of my favorites. Um, so I got this one and I got the candle that doesn't look too like wintry. It just kind of looks like cozy. The next one that I got was mahogany teak wood. Oh man, this one smells so good. This one smells straight up like men's cologne was just put into a candle. Like it smells so good though. I love it. I had this one. I actually bought this candle a few years ago and I loved it. So I'm really excited to have that one again. And that one will be good like any time of the year. And then my last one that I got, uh, this is more of a wintry scent. This is a cinnamon stick and it's just a plain red candle. Um, I really liked this one. 
because I really do like the scent of cinnamon and this one doesn't smell too, too strong in the, in the candle. So, I don't know. I thought I would try it. I don't really usually get scents like this, so I was just trying to get different stuff. But it was crazy in there. The line was like out the door. But I decided to come to the Bath and Body Works that was closer to me because um, I didn't feel like driving all the way out to Dustin just to find out that they might not have what I wanted. And this one was, um, they, were, they were running out of a lot, but they still had good ones. And I actually had a hard time even picking four that I wanted because I did get like three or four candles last time I was here. And um, I'm not really a person that likes to stock up on candles like it takes me a while to burn through a candle because I don't burn candles 24 7 um yeah I'm really glad that I that I went my little brother just FaceTime me so I'm getting ready to call him back and then I'm going to head home I might go through Starbucks I have like a major headache oh, I think it was because I was crying this morning but uh, I don't know I'm having a rough day but it's getting a little bit better so I'll see you guys when I get home I leave the TV on when I go places so that he doesn't have to sit in silence, huh? He's like, what did you bring home? Nothing for you. Nothing for you. Come here. Oh. Hi. Guys, he's so tall, huh? He's almost as tall as me. For reference, I'm four foot 11. But look how big he is. He's a big boy. Guys, I totally thought that this package was a package for me that I've been waiting for. Turns out it is not. It's a package for Devin and I don't know what it is. Devin ordered this for himself off Amazon, uh, but I told him that he has to wait until Christmas. So I'll show you guys what it is. But it's this little wooden box. I can open this. Okay. Ooh. If you guys don't know, we're big Steelers fans in this household. And so he ordered this. I think this is like $50. I don't know. But it comes in this wooden box like this. And it has six of them. Can you guess what it is? If you know anything about football, it is <laughs> replicas of the six Steelers um, Super Bowl rings. So the Super Bowls have won six Super Bowl. What? The Steelers have won six Super Bowls. So these are like replicas of the little rings. I think that's kind of cool, but anyways, Devin likes to collect stuff like this, so I'm gonna put it back and I'm gonna save this for Christmas. Okay, so I'm not feeling too hot, but I'm gonna change into comfy clothes, so much better. So I think I'm gonna take my computer downstairs and work on some school, some YouTube stuff. Probably take a nap because I'm really tired. I only got like four hours of sleep last night and it was like really broken up. But um, I'm in my very messy office right now. Uh, my whole house is kind of a mess right now, but <sighs> everything is like on the floor. I haven't really like clean cleaned lately, so. I just turned on the Grinch and Sherman is relaxing over there. So I think I'm gonna take a nap. It's also like raining so bad outside. I have like an insane headache and I think part of it is because I didn't drink enough water today. Um, this vlog today is probably going to be super boring so I apologize in advance. Um, one thing I am going to do later, I do have to pack Devin's lunch for work and I actually posted on my like community tab here on my YouTube channel. If you guys never look at that, you should because um, every once in a while I'll post like a photo with like an update or something like that So I did a poll if anybody would like to see me go live today because I wasn't I'm not posting a vlog today because I'm vlogging on um, December 1st and then starting December 2nd, so um, I'm gonna try to go live on YouTube later um, I don't know if anybody will really watch because I don't know if anybody has me actually like on notifications 
but I don't really know how that works, so we'll see. Um, but I'll like video that too. Maybe I'll do it like on my MacBook. But I'm just like chilling. I've been sleeping. I had to turn my air back on because it's freaking 70 degrees, and I was hot. My house was like 75, which is like really hot for me. Um, I get really hot really easily, so. Chairman is being something else today. I'll update you guys when there's something to update. Hello people. So I'm getting ready to pack Devin's lunch. Um, you guys seem to be really interested in this. So I thought I would include it. This is the lunch box. Whoop, let me skip back. This is the lunch box that I use or we use or he uses, whatever. Um, I got this at, or I could, actually I think we found it at Kmart. Um, it's actually like a beer cooler. <laughs> But we use it for his lunches. So he let's move you guys up a bit. Hmm, how can I sit you here? Devin, when he got home this morning, uh put his lunchbox in the fridge. So I haven't unpacked it. He didn't eat anything. He literally still has everything left in here. So I guess I'll just show you. I guess he has almost everything left. I'll just show you what um I'm gonna put in here for tonight. So um I have wheat thins in here, which I always pack. He has been eating less on night shift, so I've been kind of packing less than I was like a while ago when I was showing you what I was packing him. These are just some cut up apples. These I pack every time, like little cheese crackers. It's just like a snack for him to have. And then um, I always pack a cheese stick. And then what I packed him last night was taco soup, which you guys saw me make on my Instagram story last week. Or no, it was just a few days ago. Um, so I'm gonna leave everything in there because for some reason he didn't want to eat it. And then I'm just gonna add a yogurt and that's all I'm gonna do. So that was easy. Uh, just to clarify really quick, um, he does eat at night. Um, he hasn't been eating as much because he's just not as hungry at night as he is during the day, like when he's awake in normal hours. Um, but he has like a snack thing at work where he can like buy snacks and so he does that a lot and then um he sometimes like the nurses upstairs or whatever will bring down food if they've had like a potluck like they had thanksgiving recently so they had like food for like a day or two and stuff like that so anyways so i need to make myself something to eat for dinner because i'm literally starving and i'm supposed to be going live on in on instagram no maybe i'll have confidence to do that one day but i have like way more followers on instagram or not way more followers than I do on YouTube, but like active followers, I guess. So I'm like afraid of who would watch me on Instagram. <laughs> I'm a little bit less nervous to do it on YouTube. So let's see, Sherman. I made a lot of food. Like literally I have like six meals in here that I had like prepped for Devin's lunches that didn't get eaten. And I'm so sad about it because I just have to throw it all away. Um, I literally need to go to the store so bad. I actually have meals to make, but I didn't thaw any meat. So I'm just gonna make some of this progressive soup. Sounds yummy. Basically, this is like a really awkward clip, I feel like. But I feel like you guys are gonna really get to know me this next month because I've never like daily vlogged or like shared so much of my life. Um, so this is gonna be interesting and fun. I think you guys will like it because you'll get to know me better. My subscribers have been growing quicker lately, so I feel like um, this is like a good opportunity to get to know me and who I am. Putting that in the microwave. Um, I made the whole can even though it's like two servings. But yeah, so I'm really excited for Vlogmas because you guys have given me some really, really good uh, video ideas. Like I want to do a, this is one idea that I have. I want to make a gingerbread house with Devin and I want to record it and do a Q&A while we're doing it. So one of these days we'll do that. I don't know what day. Oh, lovely. My skin looks so beautiful today. Um, sorry that I'm like kind of being weird in this vlog. I just like am not having, I'm like having an off day like a sad day, like I just feel like down in the dumps and everybody has those days. It's okay to be sad or have a bad day. Um, so that's just, I'm having one of those days today. Unfortunately, it happens to be the first day of Vlogmas. So I'm just being real people, but my soup is almost done. I'm gonna eat that. I thought it would take way longer for me to pack Devin's lunches because whatever, I need to go to the store. I'll probably do that tomorrow. 
but I'm gonna eat this and then, hmm, I don't know what else I'm gonna do. So I'm doing my first live stream. So I know you guys can't really say hi, but everybody that's watching, I've been going, I've been going live for like an hour, over an hour. Super exciting. Hey guys, so I just got finished live streaming on YouTube for the first time. That was so much fun. Thank you to anybody who watched. Um, I really had a good time like chatting with you guys. And um, I definitely want to do that again. But Devin is awake. I'm making him a peanut butter and jelly sandwich to put in his lunch. Because he said he doesn't want taco soup. <laughs> but he'll probably eat it anyway. So I'm using crunchy peanut butter because that's the peanut butter that he likes. And I'm probably going to make one for myself as well because I'm kind of hungry still. Um, but yeah, that was so much fun. I've never, and it actually saved to my YouTube channel. So if you guys want to go watch it, you guys can go, go back and see that. It was like over an hour long though. So you might not want to watch it, but I had a really fun time. Thank you guys to those of you who tuned in. Um, I think at one point the most I ever had was like 36 people watching. So it wasn't that many people, but it was kind of cool. But Sherman's eating dinner. And um, I like the squeezy kind of jelly because it's easier. Devin likes grape jelly. Yeah, she, she did, but I didn't get it until later because I was asleep. Yeah, she likes grape jelly. Yeah, we missed everybody. We wanted to be home. Are you talking to your grandma? <laughs> Does Brady have one for the... The, the next hand? It says Christmas present. I'm making him put it back under the tree. He got it out from under the tree. When you're such a decorated teen. <laughs> Looks so cute in his uniform. He's getting ready to leave me. I'm sad. And it's oh. just just me and the Shermanator over here. Guys, my house is a disaster. Don't even look at it. And Devin's mom comes in two days. So I need to get this house in order. But... Actually, you know what? I think I'm just going to go ahead and, and end the vlog here. You want to end it with me, Devin? Yeah. Actually, come over here. There's better lighting over here. Sorry. All right, guys. Well, happy first day of Vlogmas for me. Oh, from us here at the Fox household. And I hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog. If you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe. And we'll see you in tomorrow's vlog. Bye.